Now the intuitive P and the intuitive L have a useful feature which is uh, called the offset feature. Um, and what this does, it allows you to add or subtract a fixed offset to the range of readings that the meter will normally display. Uh, a typical example of where this might be useful is in a weighing system. So if you have a, a calibrated weighing system, uh, you might, through certain reasons, need to add some mechanical device to the weighing system. For example, there may be a new uh, filling hopper that you need to add, perhaps a higher capacity filling hopper. And that hopper might weigh a completely different weight to the weight which was used in the calibration of the system. So you would need to add or subtract um, a fixed amount from your readings in order to allow for that. So the offset figure um, is, uh, is a useful way of doing that because it doesn't affect the calibration as such of your uh, load cell system. It simply adds a fixed offset or subtracts a fixed offset from the reading. Um, now in order to get into the offset setting you need to make sure that your meter is unlocked. So switch the calibration switch on the rear of the meter to the off position and you need to press the middle two buttons together for about three seconds and the display will first come up with fill which is the filter time constant press OK it'll then show LST which is the last digit roundup press OK it'll then say factor which is a fixed offset factor press OK and we now have our offset figure here so if we have for example put a container which is five kilograms less than the previous container we could add 5 kg by using the digit button to move to the units area dial in 5 and press OK and we now have 5 kgs extra showing on the display